welcome to integral mathematics like the video if you like share it do comment don't forget to subscribe don't skip the video watch till the end in this session you are going to learn real numbers show that there is no positive integer n for which root of n minus 1 plus root of n plus 1 is rational solution proof suppose there exists a positive integer positive integer n for which square root of n plus 1 plus square root of n minus 1 is a rational here n minus 1 given first i have taken n plus 1 next i have taken n plus 1 next let p by q let p by q equal square root of n plus 1 plus square root of n minus 1 where p and q are positive integers and q not equal to 0 next we will reciprocate this one will take equation 1 and next equation p if we reciprocate we will get q by P. Q by P equal one by square root of n plus one plus square root of n minus one. After reciprocal, we will rationalize. Rationalize. If we rationalize square root of n plus one minus square root of n minus one, square root of n plus one minus square root of n minus one. So one into So square root of n plus one minus square root of n minus one by a plus b into a minus b a square minus b square formula. So square root of n plus one whole square minus square root of n minus one whole square. So in numerator square root of n plus one minus square root of n minus one. So whole square. So here square root we can write one by two 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 cancel. So root will remove. So n plus one minus of n minus one. Next, square root of n plus one minus square root of n minus one by n plus one. Take minus inside. If we take minus inside, minus n plus one. So minus n plus n cancel. So square root of n plus one minus square root of n minus one by two. Now. Here we have q by p. We have q by p. So divide to change multiple two. So two times of q by p equal square root of n plus one minus square root of n minus one. Equation two. So equation one p by q equal n plus one plus n minus one. Equation two two time of two q by p equals square root of n plus one plus square root of n minus one. So first we'll add equation one and two. Equation one plus equation two. Equation one plus equation two. If we add equation one and two, equation one is left hand side we have p by q plus here we have second equation two q by P equal n plus one plus square root of n minus one and plus square root of n plus one minus square root of n minus one. So these two will cancel. So here right hand side we will get two times of two times square root of n plus one. If we take LCM, P Q is LCM. So here we can multiply by P. So P square plus 2q square by pq and here divide to multiple to change 
divide to so we can write square root of n plus 1 equal p square plus 2 q square by 2 time p q take this one equation 3 next we will subtract equation 1 minus equation 2 equation 1 minus equation 2 equation 1 p by q minus 2 q by p equal square root of n plus 1 plus square root of n minus 1 minus if you take minus inside minus square root of n plus 1 minus into minus plus square root of n minus 1 so now plus n plus 1 minus n plus 1 cancel now again we will get here 2 times here we will get 2 times of n minus 1 so that 2 we can change it divide so finally we will get square root of n minus 1 equal p square minus 2q square by 2 time of pq the same process only so here minus so p into p p square q so 2 into q square by here multiple 2 change divide 2 so 2 time of pq so we have here equation 3 and 4 so from 3 and 4 only from 3 and 4 from equation 3 and 4 we can say square root of n plus 1 and square root of n minus 1 are rational because because p and q are integer because p and q are integer implies p square plus 2 q square by 2 time of p q and p square minus 2 time of q square by 2 p q are rational p and q are integers so sure it will be if you substitute any number so we will get rational number so p and q are rational so with implies p square plus 2 q square by 2 p q and p square minus 2 q square by 2 p q are rational next n n plus 1 and n plus 1 and n minus 1 n plus 1 and n minus 1 are are perfect square are perfect square of positive integer perfect square of positive integers now see it in case if we subtract n plus 1 minus of n minus 1 n plus 1 minus n plus 1 so minus n plus n cancel so we will get 2 which is not possible which is not possible which is not possible since any 2 since any two perfect square perfect square differ differ by at least two differ by at least three sorry differ by at least three but here we have only two so since any two perfect square differ by at least three ends ends there is no positive hence there is no positive integer there is no positive integer n for which is a rational number once again 
he has given square root of n minus 1 plus square root of n plus 1. First I have taken p by q equals square root of n plus 1 plus square root of n minus 1. Next rationalize. If it rationalize uh, p, q by p, q by p reciprocal after reciprocal we have done rationalize. The rationalize a square b a plus b into a minus b. So a square minus b square. So here divide 2. So divide 2 change multiple so 2. So 2 q by p equal to square root of n plus 1 minus square root of n minus 1 equal to. So 1 and 2. First we are adding 1 and 2. While adding time here plus positive value negative value cancel. If it cancel we will get here 2 time of n plus 1 equal p by q plus 2 q by p. So on denominator are not equal we have to find the LCM. Of finding LCM p and q is LCM. So here p square plus 2 q square by p q equal 2 time of square root of n plus 1. And here multiple 2 change divide 2 so in divide 2p q equation 3 equation 4 see while adding time we are getting here plus while subtraction time we are getting here minus so square root of n plus 1 equal square root of p square plus 2 q square by 2 p q here subtracting time square root of n minus 1 equal p square minus 2 q square by 2 p q so adding time here also plus here also plus subtracting time here minus here also minus and equation 3 and 4 while comparing equation 3 and 4 we can confirm that square root of n plus 1 and square root of n minus 1 are rational why because p and q are integers so p square plus positive value p square plus 2 q square by 2 p q and p square minus 2 q square by 2 p q are rational next year they said there is no positive integer we have to there is no positive integer so n plus 1 and n minus 1 are perfect square of positive integer now n plus 1 minus of n minus 1 and n plus 1 take minus inside minus n and plus 1 and minus n plus n cancel 2 which is not possible since any two perfect square differ by at least 3 since any two perfect square differ by at least 3 in case 1 square 1 and 2 square 4 so 4 minus 1 is 3 next if I take 2 square 4 and 3 square 9 so at least 3 but hence there is no positive integer n for which is rational number these steps are important so refer it clearly thank you